Welcome back, ladies and gents, to Jabberoo Triple Sevens channel. Ah, uh, let's see what we got going on here. I think I am cooking up some forged iron along with smelting some more of the clay. Uh, got lots of time, I think, on that in there. Look at this. A few more uh, wood frames in there just in case. Over here, we're cracking out a bunch of the uh, uh, iron spikes. Uh, last time we left, you guys, I think I was cooking up some uh, cornbread. And red tea, which we did. Oh, yeah, that's the other thing. I think I got an infection fighting off a roaming horde. Uh, so I gotta go cure that infection. Let's drink a couple red tea. <coughs> Excuse me, drink a couple of the red teas. We'll take the antibiotic. Um, this will cure the infection at 25%, so we're doing pretty good at that. We could have also used a, um, a jar of honey, which will actually, uh, I think it shows it right here, cures 5% infection. So that could have been fine to take that, but we're doing okay, we're doing okay. Um, two things I want to do here, guys. I want to go and, in this video, I'm going to grab the airdrops we have outstanding. And we've got the one, two... We have three airdrops. I'm not sure where the third one is. could have sworn it was, like, right here the other day on the map. So it's, uh... Uh, where is that? Okay, we just found this right here. Found this right here. So where is this one? Show on the map. Oh, that's a... That's a mark I can't see because it's in the snow, I guess. Uh, huh. Well, that's weird. Anyways, we'll just go to it. <laughs> so... Uh, oh, yeah, and we're going to do that, and then we also have, <coughs> sorry, it's in the food chest here. Uh, we have a bunch of beer. Let's just take three beer with us. We have this quest here, kill any zombie, um, and it's with your, uh, with your fist while you're drunk. So let's go ahead and take a look at what that one gets us. That's good. There's a kill any zombie requirements. You'd be bare hands, and you need to have the beer buff on. And you're going to get 875 experience, 491 Duke's tokens, and I believe this is one that you actually just turn in and you just get it right away and you don't have to go back to the trader and turn it in uh, that's where these other quests here come in as well such as uh, you know killing the dogs challenge and stuff like that so we're gonna do that uh, that beer one as well I'm gonna drop down here I don't think I break a leg if I get down there I don't um, <clears throat> I dug this this up here we're gonna put the uh, uh, these rebar frames down because they are gonna upgrade as you can see as this one's drying straight to reinforce concrete that'll save us some time and then I just kind of measured it over here um, the same sort of a pattern and then we'll continue to the next corner and then around the back and dig out of course this corner here and then that's it we should have our little, uh, little moat done I'm gonna be working on that over the next couple of days at night and offline uh, right now let's go round up some uh, some of these airdrops I got one looking like it's over here <clears throat> so let's go grab it and then we'll uh, find some zombies do the drunken beer quest on the way and we'll go from there. We'll see what we want to do after that, guys. We'll see what we want to do after that. Oh, hang on one second here. Oh, gosh darn it. I got, got to set a timer. If I don't set a timer, I'm going to go way past my time. And that's not cool, so let me go ahead and set the timer. <clears throat> Trying to keep my videos at 25 minutes, guys. I don't know. Some of them need to be a little bit longer because of what we're doing. Um, other ones, it doesn't really matter. It's just kind of, kind of fun goof around, having some fun, so... All right, so I know there was lots of water over this way, but there's definitely, with this kind of terrain, there's definitely a uh, path to get through it. <laughs> I do like this terrain, but it's a little bit hard. Oh, and that's the other thing I have in my, uh, my inventory bag uh, that you guys probably already saw. Uh, let's get off of here. Uh, right here guys, I made the motorcycle. That's the other thing we we're doing is we we're making the parts for the motorcycle. I finished off the parts, grabbed the engine, grabbed the uh, chassis, I made up the motorcycle. The parts take about five to six minutes each one to make. Uh, the motorcycle itself only took about two, so it wasn't too bad. All right, okay, okay. Basically, scrap, scrap, and scrap. <laughs> but uh, that airdrop is uh, kind of useless to us. All right, so let's get rid of that one. Uh, the only other drop I, other one I know of is up here. So let's go up here. It's gonna be north. Back up this way, guys. 
So we're going to head over here, grab this airdrop, and then we will uh, try to find that last one. If I can't find it, we'll just work on doing the quest. And uh, probably go back and grab a couple other quests, maybe even out of the box, uh, the storage box, and, uh, and we'll do them. I mean, it's just, we got to get some questing uh, done at some point, right? And as far as the leveling goes, I believe I actually did uh, earn one more level, one more point off camera. It wasn't, wasn't much. And what I did with that was I actually spent that right into, uh, I want to say it was actually the motorcycle perk I took. I don't think I had that bot yet. I had the mini bike one. I did not have the motorcycle one, I believe. Um, if it wasn't that, the only other thing I did with the perk is I would have, would have bought the um, <clears throat> electrical perk which allows me to make the electrical generators, lights, and spotlights, and all that kind of stuff. Uh, definitely want to brighten up the base. Definitely want to get some uh, electric traps and stuff like that going. we got to put up some electric fences on the outside of our little moat uh, that we're doing and uh, see if that kind of makes us a little more uh, a little more prepared. Now this here is... This is the military base, guys, that I wanted to go to the last time. Yeah, we ended up doing this military base. This is the one I wanted to go to last time. Okay, so we'll just have to remember that that's right there on that corner. And we'll come back to it. That's, this was fun. This one goes down underground, has lots of little hidden passages. I don't think I've ever done a video on that one. So we're going to go into that one. Uh, but we're going to do what we said we're going to do first. And we'll go from there. It's kind of cool. I like this. Uh, I like the ride. There's no music for some reason right now. I didn't turn it off. It's just not playing. <laughs> I'm not sure why that is. <clears throat> but it is what it is, yeah. Okay. Eventually we have to see what kind of mods they have. Because um, there's a mod uh, launcher that you can get. And the mod launcher then will... You know, allow for whatever mods people are making to be uh, to be loaded up, and you can play some games that've got crazy loot, lots of guns, lots of killing. Then you have other mods that are just all about um, a real slow, slow-paced struggle. Which, to be honest with you, I'm not about the slow-paced struggle. This one here, this is the base version of the game that we're playing, and it's already slow. So and that's with the experience boosted. Don't forget, I've got my experience at 175%. Oh, that was good. Look at that. More antibiotics, <clears throat> more bullets, which we definitely need, and uh, first aid kits, lots of food. That was a good find. That was a good find. Uh, we're getting a little bit down on the stamina. Let's go ahead and eat the food now. Mm, chicken soup. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Okay. Alright. Ooh, look at that. There's a buck right over there. Okay, I just want to clear this. Get this guy. They're such spazzes. Oh my god, slow down. Ridiculous. I need to get the sniper rifle to be able to get that guy, evidently, but... <clears throat> okay, we're going to get that new airdrop to drop. So I just want to see if this guy's bleeding out. Sometimes they'll bleed out. He's still here. There we go. Excellent, excellent. Put the knife in here. Let's grab this guy. We need some meat. So this is good. This has been a good little run. We haven't done a lot, but it's still a good little run. There you go. 30 meat. Now there is a perk. There is... I don't know if it's a perk. Animal tracker? I think it's this one here. Uh, yeah, eyesight crouch down. Uh, crouch down and use your keen eyesight to find the tracks. Small animals uh, like snakes or chickens. Tracked animals uh, are marked on your compass and map. Trail finder your heightened sentences to detect the wildlife sneaking. Uh, whilst when sneaking, deer may show on your compass. And then you advance sentences to detect. I think there's one here. Let me just go through the wolves, coyotes. 
you become the ultimate tracker. Your senses are unparalleled. You can detect predators like mountain lions. Now, there's another one that actually allows you to get, and it might be under the knife perk, but it actually allows you to get um, uh, better, uh, what do you call it, better meat. So you would, uh, maybe another Master Chef? Nah, Master Chef's all about cooking stuff. Yeah, not sure. But anyways, you get, you get more meat, basically, from uh, from everything that you were doing. Oh, wow, that dropped up here. All right, we'll go get that um, airdrop right now since we're close. It was over here. And this is, uh, again, another city we haven't gone to. Once we, Oh, you know what? Darn it, I should have really put the bike down, guys, and I don't have any gas. <laughs> if I had gas on, I just put the motorcycle down. We could use the motorcycle. But since we're on this uh, pedal bike, we'll just keep using it. Uh, and then we'll get we'll get some gas we get back. You guys are going to love the chopper, man. Oh, God, it's got such a nice sound for those that haven't, heard, that haven't seen it. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. I think it's got a little bit of a bigger inventory. Not quite sure. I bet you that airdrop's still falling, is it? No. It is down already. Wow. And there it is right there. Pretty crazy. Easy to get. Let's get this one. Iron arrows. I know we could keep them, but I'm just... Not all about them. We did get another quest. What's this one? Kill the Wabbit Challenge? I have no idea what this is. It's a strange note I discovered in my travels. Blah, 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 blah. You have to kill some rabbits, I guess. They probably spawn and come after you. Maybe uh, something I might want an AK for. Not quite sure. Um, okay, let's go ahead. Let's pop the uh, pop the couple. Oh, well, first of all, you have to kill two zombies. Let's try to find at least two zombies in the wild. Oh, I could have sworn we just went by some. Uh, this is cool, this town over here. we got to explore more of this town. I want to get, once we get the bike going, um, we got to come out this road here, and I'm just going to go straight into the green zone over here, see what other towns we get. Uh, I'm kind of disappointed that the skyscrapers are not back in the game. They may be back in the game for the next one. I'm not sure. Uh, you know, for the next patch, I'm not sure. Uh, they're huge, huge dungeon crawls. Super fun. Tons of loot. Always have to have a drop box out front. Uh, so that would definitely be fun. Uh, let's see if we can stir up a couple zombos in this town here. Not really seeing a lot of guys walking outside. Huh, that's kind of odd. The bear den. Yeah, yeah, we're going to go in there when we have the AK. <laughs> Not just our fists and drunk. Bob's Cafe, Doggos, Doggos, <laughs> got some dogs in there. Uh, military base, it's got some healing stuff. I bet you that would be okay to loot. Ooh, there's a Zombo. Gotta watch out though, they've got the, I uh, uh, got the Lamites all over front here. Okay, so we got her fist, so she doesn't blow herself up, we'll be good. Come on lady, over this way, good, good. So I have to have the beer buff on. So, buzzed, I don't know. I don't know if that's uh, going to count or not, but let's try it. Oh, the haymaker. Oh, that counted. There we go. Okay. So we still have one minute left on the buff. So we will um, we'll try to ride our bike straight and uh, find another zombie and get that quest on. Man, this guy had two beers. He's zonked. I guess they were pretty strong beers. There's like the uh, Apocalypse Spears. Oh my goodness, a crack a book. Oh yeah, we need this, guys. We need this. this is a good find. I, I don't know which one I want to do first, the military base or the crack a book, but we are going to mark mark this here crack a book. Which is my, uh, this should be my commercial building uh, thing here, so we're going to do a uh, crack a book. <laughs> my guy's all kinds of blurry yet. Uh, let's drop the knife. Actually, wait, no, we can do that with the fire axe. There we go. Beautiful. A little bit better armor, but it's heavy armor rating. What have we got on for boots now? Oh, we got the level threes. Yeah, we'll just scrap those. Uh, we're basically after some better gloves. That's leather gloves, leather chest. I mean, we just need to make a little higher quality and or loot a little higher quality. But other than that, I think we should be good. Oh my gosh, I really want to go in here, guys. I really, 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 really. 
What in earth? <laughs> I was like, did I wake something up already? Alright, let's see if we can do this quest at the same time. We've only got one beer left, though, so let's try to get some zombies to come out after us. Come on, zombies. Oh, Jesus, a cop. You can see he's spitting in there. We're going to have to kill him. He is a spitter. And he runs and blows up if you don't. If you don't kill him before he gets up to you. He, uh, they, they run and they just go right up to him and they go, Rah! blow right up, so. That's no good. Oh, good, good, good. We stirred up the neighborhood. Stirred up the neighborhood. I think if we just do one beer, we'll get a minute on the buff. About 40 seconds. That should be enough to. Yeah. Oh, we do have to talk to the trader. You do still have to talk to the trader. The only other advantage is their stamina is definitely coming back quicker. I hear someone out here. <laughs> yeah, so that's my blurred vision from the beer, guys. That'll wear off in about five, five seconds, four seconds there on the bottom. We definitely have to hit this cracker book a little while we're here. I mean, it's one of those ones that all those books and stuff that we don't have yet, this is where we're going to get them. This is where we're going to get them. So let's loot this while we're here. We're already overburdened, so why not? Why not? Nothing in there. Nothing behind that guy. Uh, ooh, yes. Steel armor schematic. Green schematic will teach you how to craft this item. Yes, please. May I have some more? Um... Oil? Oh, we knew how to make the oil one already, I believe, but we'll take it again. Oh, it's not as many, uh, as many shelves as there was in the old one, but... Uh, the water schematic, we already know that. Ranger's Guide, not sure if we know it or not. Oh, yes, Iron Breaker mod. Totally need that. I wonder it would be interesting. It should tell you if you already know it. Like there should be a little symbol that says, "Oh, you already know this," so you can uh, so you can do some sort of a uh, uh, scrapping it for the paper instead. I don't I don't know why they don't do that. Oof, getting lots of quests out of here. Got top and bottom, nothing in that, nothing in that, something like this. Ooh, yay, glass block that we really don't need. Bulletproof glass. I totally would take the bulletproof glass. More paper. I can always use the paper. Uh, insulated liners. We'll take that. We'll take that other quest. Oh, blood rockets. Speaker schematic. Oh, excellent. Excellent finds. Wow. Loving it. Loving it. Loving it. Loving it. Uh, a little more paper. Oh, yeah, Pistol Pete. Hollow point ammunition. This allows you to craft the hollow point 9mm ammunition. We're going to read that. Night Stalker. Do 10% more sneak damage at night. I think we might have already had that one. Nonetheless, looting this will get it to start respawning on a forest in five days. And now that we know where there is one. Now that we know where there is one. Oh my gosh, she was feral. This guy's not, so we can just take him out with good old fashioned. Club to the noggin. Cat food. I love me some cat food. Post apocalyptic cat food. <laughs> Thanks for a good snack. Scrap the gun, take the bottle of water. Coffee beans. I don't know if somebody thought they were mushrooms. Scrap the brass. Oh my gosh, we're full, full. Hmm. Eat the tuna. K 
kind of want to keep that jar of honey separate. We're doing okay. We're doing okay. All those pictures aren't going to really loot me to anything because they're on the uh, uh, they're on the outer wall. Oh, meat stew, maximum of 50, uh, plus health and water. Done. Ate ourselves some stew. Oh, more beer if we want it. <laughs> uh, coffee beans, I think, are probably better. Don't really know. There's not really anything I want to get rid of, so... I have to leave the beer. That's sacrilegious, I know, but we have to do it once. Did I loot that one already? No, it's one beer in each one. Darn it! Darn it, darn it, darn it, man! It's kind of a creepy, uh, annoying sign. There was no run in there for me. Uh, kill the rabbit challenge. There's always, man, we, all these challenges we're going to do, they're going to be fun. Honestly, I think we're going to drop the painkillers. Wait a minute, how much does painkillers sell for? 80 per, uh, for the, yeah. Yeah, we'll keep them for now. We'll just, we'll just try to loot these book boxes. Read what we can read. Ooh, contact grenade schematic. They seem like they're going to be locked in there for a little bit. So we're going to leave them in there to do their thing. When we finish looting. Stay in there, buddy. There's only one guy. Ooh. Tempered blade. Reading the schematic will teach you how to craft this item. A tempered blade. Wow. I don't know what that does. That's awesome. Oh, the rocket launcher schematic. Yes, please. Definitely could find. Is he through yet? I'll be pulling the scrap polymers out of there and putting them on the ground so that the box will respawn. But other than that, we're good. Uh, shotgun Messiah 4. Shotgun Slugs. Heck yeah, we're going to take that. Sorry, bud. You gotta go. You gots to go. <laughs> you just got to go. What is this one here? Cable guys never made it challenge. I don't know what that is. We should come back in here and get that one. That looks kind of fun. Do some of those challenges. Oh, there's a box over here I'm not sure I got. Did not. Ooh, art of mining. Too much ore slowing down. Craft all those small pieces into a pallet. Ooh. Oh, that's nice. A hunter mod. Reading the schematic will teach you how to craft this item. The hunter mod. Don't know what the hunter mod does. We'll look up all of our mods uh, once we get out of here. Got some. Uh oh, that's my alarm going off there. More honey. Liking it. Liking it. Okay, let's just go ahead and dump what we have in the bike. Guys still roaming around out here. Okay. So let's put some of the like the uh, the the honey, the food stuff, uh, the water that I'll, that can all go in the bike. Leather, that schematic can go in there. Coffee beans and the painkillers. Where'd that guy go? It sounds like he's walking right behind me. Let's kill him for good measure. Jeez. That was a creature. Okay. <clears throat> Just want to get that other quest that we can get from in here. I'm surprised that when you do those quests... Maybe I didn't get this quest the way I thought I got it, but I th thought this was a quest that... Uh, you know, the fist fight zombies that we just did. I, I could have sworn it came from one of these red... Uh, one of these little, um, you know, challenge papers. And I'm pretty sure that you're supposed to just like instantly turn it in. I, I'm not sure why, because I haven't found any other traders in the area. This is a uh, 
The swig and serum. Yeah, I don't know why. I don't know why I can't find any other traders. So let's let's come back onto the road this way and see if we can't um, uh, just see if we can't open up that area. Maybe we'll see a trader or something on the way. Sometimes we're just in the outskirts of town. No idea what this is, but that looks freaking cool. It is a uh, what is this? Oh, it's a cafe. Pretty serious looking cafe by the size of the the pipe they've got on the roof there. All right, so we're just gonna go back over to this little area here, guys. See if we can't see on the way another trader's building. Usually, you just stumble across them. You're not even sure where where you got them. Uh, but we're gonna go ahead and take a quick look. Kind of open stuff up here. Uncovers it on the mini map. Sometimes you'll see a building or a part of a building, and you can go and uh, kind of investigate. But I'm not seeing anything out here. This whole area is looking buildingless. Mm. Well, that's what it is. That's what it is. Let's go back, and we will. Ooh, there's a nice little. Uh, those are cool. Those little abandoned places are cool. There's usually a zombie bear in the bottom, so I'm not going in there without some uh, some reinforcements. Got the uh, academy. There's another academy here. We haven't looted this academy yet. Got the buses out front. This would be cool. This would be cool. Lots of stuff to loot out here. What is this? Oh, the fire station. Yeah, I don't know that we did the fire station yet. Here's another dungeon crawl house right here that we can do. I think what we're going to do though is just go back over to our little uh, our little base and we are going to take the uh, end of the video there. I'll organize the stuff um, off camera and probably go and get us down for the trader for the next one. Uh, and I'll get the bike ready guys so we can drop the bike and you guys can see what the bike is all about. The motorcycle is. In fact, we could probably just do that real quick right now. Uh, you just got to bear with me. I ain't got no stamina. Carrying too much stuff. Okay, so in here, let's drop off some of these. Hopefully, some of them are dupes. There's only a couple of them that are dupes. Uh, so we'll we'll, <laughs> we'll deal with the rest later. What else can go in here? Um, paper can't go in there. The bones can go in there. The cobblestone is maxed out for what I can carry in there. Okay. So we'll grab. We don't need that much gas. We'll just grab, grab like a thousand gas right here. Let's go put the bike down, guys. So you can you can have a little, little sound sound test. I want to close that door. Okay. All right. So this here, this here is our motorcycle. I'll put it down on the road just so it doesn't. Look at that. Look at that beast. Oh, she's so cool. Okay. Gas her up. And you'll see in the storage on it too, you have a lot more storage. So, wow, it took all the gas. Listen to this. Oh my gosh, listen to that rumble. Oh, yes. That is a cool. Very cool looking bike right there. Super cool. <laughs> okay guys, so this bike here. If we take the stuff out of this bike. Now we can actually take our bike. So now we have our motorcycle. That's now gonna be our bike. And you'll see that that now has the uh, motorcycle symbol on the mini on the little uh, mini compass. And that'll be what we use. Just so I remember. Oh gosh, my map just went all haywire on me here. Just so I remember what we're going to do is I'm going to put the red flag right on that military compound that I know is a, uh, it's definitely uh, one of those dungeon ones that goes down below. All kinds of cool zombies in there, guys. We'll do that during the day when they're not running, and we will do it early so that we can do the whole video down there, basically. And I'll take the AK for that one because it's going to be needed. <laughs> so, okay, guys. Hope you liked the video. Here's some of the loot that we got. Um, go ahead and give me a like, and if you're new to the channel, give me a subscribe. 
I'll keep the videos coming. I'll keep. Uh, we, we've got a new new series up there now. I'm doing some episodes of American Trucking Simulator. Um, I'm going to put a couple more of those up. I'm going to do some more of the Car Mechanic Simulator, and then there's a couple other games I got to get up there as well. So, guys, take care for now. Happy gaming, and until next time, cheers for now.